What's going on guys? It's your boy Jesse D123 back with another video and today we're going to be debuting the 99 overall Cy Young Award winner Bob Gibson. Now first of all RIP to my man he just passed away what was it maybe like two weeks ago week and a half ago man it's crazy another legend just died um I think it was yesterday or today I am butch I don't know his name bro I seen it on social media so you guys probably know who I'm talking about but man 2020 has been rough bro. A lot of MLB legends have been passing away. Now, they're very old, don't get me wrong, but I mean, man, it just sucks, bro. Like, I know age is, death is, like, inevitable. It's going to happen to all of us, but, like, man, all of these uh, MLB legends are dying, man. But it is what it is. It's a part of life. But um, we're just getting, we're going to get the debut on with this card, man. I'm super excited for it. Now, I've seen a, kind of mixed reviews on this card, man. So, I've seen some people say it's good. I've seen some, I see some, <laughs> I've seen some people say, it's not that good now he has a four seam at 98 does he have an outlier no he does not so he has a four seam at 98 a slider at 90 a sinker at 95 a curveball and a changeup. kind of wish he had a, a cutter but i mean i like that he has that sinker and that slider so i can i can oh and the changeup too yeah it could be very effective with that his stats are 125 stamina 109 hits per nine 105 strikeouts per nine walks per nine is 90 um Velocity is 96, 99 break. His control is 87, so it's not, it's good, bro. It's good, 87. If it was lower towards like 85, 84, then it would be shaky, but is what it is. 89 fielding, 97 arm, so man. Oh, he could hit two? 46 contact against lefties? 34 contact against lefties? I mean, righties? Man, and if you guys don't see the elephant in the room, man, like, Lakers, baby. We the champions. <laughs> Shout out to the Lakers, man. We got the job done on, what is it? What's today? Tuesday I'm recording this? We got the job done on Monday, man. Man, that game was crazy. We blew the heat out, bro. That's insane, bro. That first half of basketball was just probably the best bas basketball the Lakers played all year, bro. They shut them down. Held them to like 30-something points in the first half? What other team is out there doing that, man? And all the people doubting the Lakers? Are they crazy? Doubting LeBron James, I mean, you know the media, the media hates LeBron James. And some people hate him too, you know, I mean, like, it just comes with the territory. This man's just a winner, and people don't like winners. Like, look at Tom Brady, look at LeBron James, look at Derek Jeter. Like, people don't like to see people succeed. And it's it's sad, but it's just a world we live in, man. But shout out to the Lakers. We got number 17. We did it for Kobe, man. We did it We did it for the city of Los Angeles, bro, just because... We've, we've been in a drought, bro. Now, the Dodgers took an L today. They're down 0-1 to the Braves in the series, man. Keem, we coming for you, bro. We coming for you. Now, I know this is a long-ass intro. I'm trying to cut it down a little long. I'm trying to cut it down. Try to end it right now. But I just wanted to say that, man, man, that the Lakers did it for the city of Los Angeles, man, because we've been in a drought. Now, the Dodgers, they going to do it this year as well. Keem, we coming for you, bro. We might be 0-1 down in the series, but it don't matter. It's first to four, so that's all that matters. Y'all got one game. It's cool. We come back tomorrow, win the next game. That's all that matters. But, yeah, man, so let me shut up. Let me go ahead, let me show you guys the team real quick. Um, I'm not going to change it up too much. Jose Hermes is going to get, an, a, a, hopefully, a better debut. Hopefully, a better one. Um, but, yeah, we didn't change the team up. We didn't change the team up at all. Um, uh, the only change that we did is that Bob Gibson, Bob Gibson is going to start. And we're 45 and 11, man. We're at 639. One win should put us one win away from division series. Let's hope we can get it. It's 10:38 p.m. I've no, I've heard and I've known that playing this late is not good. Hopefully, I can get a little blessed on my side, but um, who knows? Stay tuned. Drop a like if you guys are excited, man. Drop a sub if you guys aren't sub, man, because we're on the road to 600 subscribers. We're almost there. And uh, just welcome to the team, man. Just because we're building a positive community around here, and I want you guys to be a part of it. And I want you guys to be like, damn, I've been here since 589, 569, 500, 400, 300. Shout out to all my OGs. They've been here since like 100, 200, 300. And they've, they've seen the growth. And we're only going to continue to keep growing, man. So I'm telling you guys now, hop on the team now because I want you guys to become OGs. But without further ado, guys, let's get right into the video. All right, guys, for once, SDS did not bless us with the home team. And let's see what we're going up against. Los Angeles, Kings, I Lopes, uh, Bruce Dark, Gratter, okay. Um, Hanley Ramirez. Chuck Bizzle, Chipper, Royce Lewis, Larry Walker, Yasmani Grandel, Carlos Correa, and Cody. All right, something tells me this man is uh, just coming up to the game, I think. He has that prestige Chipper, but I just think maybe he might be a newcomer. I don't know. Let's see his record. Uh, 115 and 96. Never mind, man. This guy's no scrub. He grinds Diamond Dynasty, ranked seasons. He's probably a monster, bro. And we're playing in Dodger Stadium. All right, I'm down with it. I'm just mad that I'm not the home team because you guys know we love playing at Capitol. 
Oh, we have someone, but we can beat that out. Oh, come on, Tatis. We can beat that out. What? Oh, my goodness, bro. Tatis, come on, bro. That's my fault, too, for check swinging, but come on. He should have been, he should have been beat that. What is that, 86 speed or 84 speed versus Gratterall? How much speed he got? Okay. You want you want to walk Mickey? I'm going to make you pay for that. We still in first pitch. Yes, sir. He's in there. Oh, hell yeah. He's in there. Look at my boy Mickey. Stealing, baby. Quick. All right, Cody. Knock him in right here. What a boy that's gone. That's launched. That's gone. Home run, baby. Let's go. That's exactly why we threw Cody back on the squad, baby. He's such a threat, bro. A lot of people show this man a lot of disrespect because I don't see him on a lot of squads no more. And frankly, I don't know why. He has so much power. And if you throw him in right field, bro, he has a cannon. 99 arm strength. Nobody better not run on him, bro. Because if they do, he's getting thrown out. Oh, come on, Joe. That's my fault. It's all good, man. We got a two-run lead. I like that, especially because we're the away team. Very, very important. Jose, who is that? Ramirez? Not Jose Ramirez, is it? I'm tripping. Am I tripping, guys? I don't remember who's uh, leading off for him. Oh, Hanley Ramirez. We gas Hanley. All right. Let's see how this Bob Gibson card is, man. I know that he had a player program earlier in the year, and I made like a fastest way to unlock that. Um, And the way you unlock this card, if you guys didn't know, is through his conquest map. You complete the whole conquest map, get some rewards, um, and then you get him ultimately when you complete the whole conquest map. Now, if you guys need to see the rewards in the conquest map, you think if they're, you need to see if they're worth it before you start grinding, go check out my video, man. It was the the Bob Gibson conquest map video. So go check that out. I'll try to see if I can link it in the top right. Remember to do so. But if I don't, go check that out. Majority of you guys probably already watched it, though. But just saying, you know. So far, I'm liking him, though, man. His windup is kind of nice. It's quick. I love people who pitch so quick, bro. It's so, so efficient. Like, I think who it is, who is it, Trevor Bauer or who else, Sonny Gray, bro? They freaking pitch so slow. And then Walker Bueller, too. Like, it's realistic for Walker, but I feel like it can be sped up a little bit, SDS. Because he throws pretty quick in real life, bro. And in the game, I feel like the animation is kind of quick, but he still doesn't get the ball released from his hand quick enough. I don't know. That's just me, maybe. We got Trout, Ruth, and Hornsby. Let's go put some more runs on the board. I am very interested for this matchup, man. Le against Larry Walker. Larry Walker is a dangerous hitter. And what did I just say? <laughs> I knew that, man. He's just, he's just a dangerous hitter, bro. He's scary. Usually, every time he puts bat on ball, the ball's flying. And it might not even be coming down. I'm not kidding. But so far, I'm liking this Bob Gibson, bro. I'm getting my daily challenge with strikeouts. I think I need one more. But this man is not the tip-top best of a, a competition. But, uh, hey, it is what it is, man. It's what I got paired up with. What is it? 2-0? Two, two well, bottom second right here. All right, man. Two balls, two strikes. Let's see if we catch up to the fastball. Not right there, though, Jesse. You put it up top right. Why didn't it go there? All right, man. Let's see. Um, let's go high inside. <laughs> What's up? I'm saying high inside. This man's throwing it dead over the middle. Like, <laughs> Do you want him to tie the game? And there we go. We finish our daily mission. I like that. Oh, Tatis. You better get there. Out of boy, bro. Look at that little animation at the end. He dope. He got it like that. I'll take that, man. I'll take that. We got a Jose Ramirez coming back up. Tatis and Mickey Mano. Let's go, baby. Let's go put some more runs on the board. Get some more hits with Jose. And more runs with Tatis, man. All right, man. One or two with Jose Ramirez. We got a lock in right here. Oh, that's a good hit. That's a good hit. That's gone. Oh, it's not gone, but it's a double. I'll take that, baby. Oh. Okay. Okay, Jose. I see you. That 90-something power against righties, bro. Perfect, perfect. <laughs> Let's go, man. Eat that with Tatis. All right, man. We got a full count with one out with Mickey, man. Let's go. The disrespect to Mickey Mano, bro. I have a feeling this guy's going to quit. Something's telling me. I might be right. I don't know. <laughs> it's 4 nothing, the man. I'll take that extra base hit with Mickey Mano, baby. We need to prestige him, too. Hey, if we can mercy rule this guy, I'm down with that, too, bro. But I need some more footage with uh, Bob Gibson. <laughs> The district, bro, like, if you're going to, I'm telling you guys, he's going to quit on me. I'm calling it right now. He's quitting on me. There ain't no way he's not. It's 5 nothing, bro. 
The disrespect to Hornsby, bro. Joe, you, oh, who is that? Oh, he's falling too. Yep, we're going. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I need Totsies to score like that, though. Six nothing, man. Like I said, I think we're going to mercy rule this guy. Let's go, Gibson. Let's get a base hit. All right, guys. I wanted to ask you guys a question. Who do you guys have in the two series that are still left? In the ALCS and in the NLCS? You guys got winning the Rays or you guys got the Astros winning? Comment, comment down below who you guys got winning. And obviously, who do you guys got winning? The Dodgers or the Braves? Now, personally, I'm uh, the way it's going right now, bro, the Rays are looking scary. Looking really scary. They're looking like a really hot team that's peaking at the right time. Um, but the, and then the Astros, bro. I mean, like they just they just plow through everybody in their wild cards in their wild card series. They plow through, freaking. They spanked the A's, which was crazy because I thought the A's were gonna do something, but nope. Um, but yeah, man. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with the Rays on the AL side, and obviously I'm gonna be biased and say the Dodgers. Now they did lose game one. It's not a worry for me though. I'm not worried about that. Who was that? Was that a pitcher got a hit? I don't think so. Um, yeah, so they lost game one. That's not a worry to me, though, man. It's cool. But the only thing that is kind of worrying for me as a Dodgers fan is their bats. Their bats were not not there, bro, in game one. They need to wake up in game two, and we'll be just fine. Because we have the players, to, we have the players, bro, who can put bat on ball. So that's what I'm saying. I'm not really that worried. But um, they, do, they do need to wake up because the Braves are scary. They're a young, hungry team. I know the Dodgers have been knocking out their Braves. For oh he took me deep with Chuck Bizzle. Okay. So far, that's my fault though. Bob Gibson Bob Gibson didn't do anything wrong right there. That was my fault. Um, but like I was saying, the the Braves are the, the Braves are hungry. The Dodgers have been knocking the Braves out. I don't wanna I wanna say the past couple years. Like I think they would meet in the C S or the or the D S and they would knock them out. I mean probably not consecutive years, but within the past five years, let's say they knocked them out of the playoffs maybe like twice, maybe three times. Maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. But um, basically what I'm saying is that the old team back then is nowhere near as good as they are now. So they're scary, bro. They have a good squad. I'm not worried, though. Not yet. But um, Dodgers Dodgers going to take the series. So I, I have a prediction of the Dodgers versus Rays in the World Series. And that's my prediction. Let me know down in the comments about your guys' prediction because I'm super curious about that. Are you guys on the Dodger side? Are you guys on the Ray side? Are you guys on the Astro side? Hopefully you guys aren't because they're cheaters. <laughs> um, but yeah, we got to go score some more runs. 6-2 uh, right now. Score six more runs and we mercy rule him. That's going to be the that's gonna be the mission. Now, I don't think that's the signature series. Let me check. We're super close to that signature series, Gossage. Yeah, it's not. Oh, he quit. What I say? What I tell you guys? He was gonna quit. Um, the debut with Bob Gibson. It was pretty. It went pretty well, man. He gave up a two-run bomb. Overall, I like his car, man. If you guys are considering getting it, considering getting it, I highly suggest you guys go do that conquest and get him. He's a free 99. He's a award series player. So if you guys need that for Trout, go ahead and go get that. Um, but overall, I, I really like his pitch selection. Um, his pitch variety is really nice, and um, his windup. His windup is super quick and super like. I don't know. I just I, I really fuck with his line, his wind up a lot, and I think overall he's a good card. So go pick him up if you guys haven't already. But yeah, guys. So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. Drop a like if you guys did. This has been your boy Jesse D123, and I'm out.